All right, let's go ahead and, and take a look at our weather. Yeah, no, I just, the more I think about Speaking it. Speaking of chips. <laughs> All right, let's take a look at uh, our cameras here throughout the county. Oh, downtown looks pretty nice. I love the colors. I love it when the clouds mix in with the colors, making way for some beautiful live pictures here. Happy Monday for those of you who do have Labor Day off and are waking up early. Unfortunately, that heat wave that is going to continue. We're also dealing with a slight chance of thunderstorms later on this afternoon. Slim chance, isolated, could potentially drift west, but we're keeping it in the forecast and then a chance of showers as we look ahead to next weekend. More 70s across the board. It's a little bit more comfortable than what we started off yesterday, and you can see our 24-hour temperature change much cooler, especially along the coast. Now, I wish I could say your daytime highs were going to be cool. That's not the case. We're still dealing with that excessive heat warning that's going to last for a few more days. It expires Wednesday night, not only here in San Diego, but if you're traveling out of county, unfortunately, you're going to be dealing with the heat here throughout most of the state. This high pressure system, that's not going away just yet. So just get used to this heat, at least for the first half of the week. Things will start to change as we look ahead to the second half of the week. Part of that is because of this. We do have a system to the south of us that we are tracking over the next few days. As it gets closer here to San Diego, we could start to feel the effects of that by Saturday. So we are keeping that chance of some light rain showers in our forecast for Saturday. And even in the eastern portion of our county could potentially linger that uh, weather the rain Saturday into Sunday 80s along our coastline. We do drop into the low 80s, upper 70s by this upcoming weekend. Our inland valley is a triple digit heat will continue with pretty warm overnights. We'll see the 80s once again by next weekend. The mountains humid. We're still dealing with the 90s and the high triple digits here in our deserts peaking on Tuesday at 115.